Hey, this this is some uh, fresh out the press. Y'all heard about that the King Kong versus Godzilla movie? It's a uh, shout out to Sir X Men because you know he used to be a big a big fan of King Kong or Godzilla, and uh, him and Lemon they were big fans of Godzilla. So uh, did y'all what y'all hear about this? Here? It get a PG thirteen. Do y'all think that King Kong versus Godzilla should have got a hard R rating, or do y'all think that uh, PG thirteen rating is a uh, pretty standard for uh, for a, a movie like that? Nah, I should get a hard rating. I think they should went all out for that one. You think they, you think they should have went all out and went with the all yeah, all out hard rating, destruction. You know, they ripping each other apart. You know, they should have right. all out. I hold nothing like, back on that one. Right, Kong biting on Godzilla and ripping some of his uh, yeah, ripping some of his scales off or something. Yeah, man, she turn around, yeah. bite the hell out of him. Right, and, and then they actually show that collateral damage. Yeah. Collateral damage should be some shit they'd be showing like when they actually mm -hmm. uh, murder some people and stuff like that. Kong falling off the arm um, of a building and hitting the ground or knocking over a building, people inside of a building jumping and hitting the ground and stuff like that. They could have had uh, come out like all that type of stuff, did they? They yeah. could have had the opportunity. No, PG 13, you can't do none of that. Right, that means they got to take half the, uh, the art and craft they could have been making in. And, and hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Stupid, <laughs> what are you watching? The Price is Right? Look like Stupid people watching The Price is Right. No, I'm watching, I'm looking at The Avengers. Oh, I'm looking at, at all right. the streaming services. The Price is Right. I was, mm -hmm. I was looking at all the streaming services I have on my TV. Netflix. <laughs> Netflix. Stupid, you pay for all those, huh? Hulu, I'm a HBO oh. Now, and CBS. All access. So, so CBS, HBO Now, Prime, Hulu, and Netflix. Plus, I have Cody somewhere. <laughs> I just sometimes can't deal with the buffering. That's why I don't really with Kobe. Cody. Yeah. With the buffering. It can't take the buffering most of the time. Sometimes it buffers too much. But... I I what most, of, most of them I use a student ID to get, so they're far cheaper. So, Stu, hey, what do you think about the uh, King Kong vs. Godzilla being PG-13? I'm an adult. I do not watch PG-13. I do not want to see Kevin Hart in every show. Kevin Hart? Kevin Hart be in Or The Rock. Oh my god, and I can bet good money that Kevin Hart or Dwayne Johnson is going to be in the Godzilla versus. King I think Kong. Dwayne Johnson was in that other movie, wasn't it? With the whole uh, gorilla, or something Rampage. Like that. That was Rampage. Rampage. That's yeah. so, game. So, 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 therefore, it's going to be Kevin Hart in this one. <laughs> Once it's Kevin Hart. It's going to be Kevin Hart or yeah. No, they hey, they had a girl of a Stranger Things on the last Godzilla movie. Um, the girl that played seven or eleven, whatever her name was. Nine, oh, ten, eleven. 11. Oh. Yeah. What you talking about? Oh. Yeah, she, yeah. She, she so they try to make it. They try to make it gritty. So, but they said it. It, uh, it ain't. It ain't gonna hit the R rate. So you're not a fan of uh, King Kong versus Godzilla being PG thirteen? No, not at all. Nah, me neither. I probably can wait till they hit Cody y'all. So. Yeah, I feel y'all feel y'all. So what about you, Chaos? I know you got I know you got a a, 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 a a unique outlook on this situation, especially especially all the King Kong Godzilla talk that we've been going through. So what you think about it being PG 13? I don't give a fuck. Yeah, you oh, yeah. 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 Hey, he it sounds like he just chatted his inner savage. Well, you won't be able to hear that word on the title. <laughs> <laughs> There's no f bomb in that. There is a shit. It's King Kong. Shit. You about to hear shit. He better drop. He about to drop the whole turret on him. But I think it might oh, be. Yeah. And he also scared me for the uh for the Suicide Squad too. But you know, it's uh, uh, it's cool. <laughs> then the point uh, of the suicide squad. No, uh, it's already late. It's already too late. It's already too late. Damage is done. I'm gonna go in my little dark corner in my dark room and cry a little bit. You know, this is all good. 
first, first, first of all, you know it ain't no turns. It's just go. <laughs> <laughs> I know. I know. I was just giving you shit, it, man. <laughs> I'm, I, I was like, hey, I figured everybody gave their point across. So I said, time to go to the next thing. Yeah, it's all good. Nah, I really didn't have nothing to say anyway, all that much. But, uh, yeah, I just wanted to give you shit for it. That's all. <laughs> we, we already talking about the monkeys and the lizards and shit. Somebody mm-hmm. was talking about pulling lizard tails off and um, calling it money bags mm-hmm. and shit. Mm-hmm. Crab legs and, yeah, and everything, you know. Yeah, the more people, oh, um, people in Florida take the uh, lizards and hang them <laughs> on their ears. Yeah, some crazy shit. Yeah. Oh, so they actually do do that out there in Florida? Oh, no. I don't know. I mean, it wouldn't surprise me. Florida is crazy, but, you know. I don't know. Uh, I, you'll probably see, like, an alligator tooth or a shark tooth hanging from somebody here, but, you know. Yeah, well... The only thing we got, I have left like little topics, like you know the AMC and uh, supposed to be shutting down their movie theaters and stuff like that, which we pretty much see that they might not make it through the coronavirus. So that's what well, I was gonna say. I mean, that's a good thing. AMC now expensive. snacks and shit was too high anyway. I, I, I don't care. It's expensive movie theater. You gotta understand that. Like four slices. You no, gotta understand. Slices of pizza. AMC. America, uh, American Movie Center that's owned by the Chinese, so I don't care. <laughs> Too expensive. Uh, there is uh, not... Send movies, you know. There is I'm just, the they, 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 the Chinese, they bought that. They bought that a few years ago. I don't care. I didn't even know that... Uh, well, I, I did hear something about that. Well... Wait, so a company that has America I, I, in it was bought by a Chinese company? Yeah. That's funny as hell. It was it was originally I forgot my man name that actually that actually made it. It was another company and he turned it to, to the AMC. And as time went on, his son was messing with it, was going down a family line or whatever. And somehow the Chinese invested in it. That's what they did. They invested in it. And after that, it, it just it went the with the trash. No, the screen's nice. I'm not saying that now. The screens are nice. The quality is nice. Uh, yeah, no, yeah, we're not saying that. We're just saying it just, it just, yeah, they I got it, and it, just went, it went. It went. It sucked. It went downhill. Yeah, but the snacks too expensive, and the drinks. Yeah, too the snacks expensive. are terrible. Yeah, and the snacks yeah. are terrible. Twenty five dollars for the box. You gotta of think about it. Really you gotta think about it. When the last time you seen somebody actually go to an AMC movie theater? No, all, the last no, there's time still people going. A lot of people go down there, but I the mean, problem is that because it may be the only. But you I, gotta I, think I, about I it.